Hello, this is Javier Cantón. I work as research team lead at Plain Concepts, and today we are pretty excited to show you that we already received our Holland 2 device. We are working hard with the Microsoft team to integrate it with our custom graphic engine called Wave Engine to start creating experiences based on all the new features. So let's see what is new compared with the first version. This version is quite a bit lighter and balanced. You can feel this first time to you tried it on. And now uh, the lens can fleet up, which is nice and safe compared to the pen of the job you have. And they also change the hardware architecture. Now they're using ARM, like, similar to your phone. And they are also improved this uh, depth camera sensor. And now the device can uh, scan and track your environment with more precision. But if you ask me about what are the main feature compared with the first version, I have to talk about the screen and the new natural interaction technology. Talking about the screen, now we have more pixel per degree that allow us to read text closer to the lenses and get more detail for far elements. And they are increase the field of view as well, which is mean that now uh, we can move our, uh, our eyes and not just look forward like in the first version. They also are integrate a uh, retina scanner and now the device and application can detect the user eyes movement. So now, for example, you can read the text and the application can scroll it for you. They also are using the retina scanner as a biometric authentication. And now when you start using the device, the device can recognize the shape of your eyes and login with the correct profile and also can adapt the render to your eyes, to the distance of your eyes. Now talk about the new natural interaction technology. Uh, in the first version, Microsoft present a device where you can see hologram around you and you can interact with them using gesture. But you need to learn this gesture before. In this version, uh, the device can recognize your hands and the skeleton of them, which is really nice and you just forget about gesture and now you can touch the holograms. You can feel like your hands, your fingers can interact with these 3D elements. So now you can push button, you can move slider or you can literally grab hologram to rotate them or use both, both hands to scale them. This is really amazing and for me the main difference compared with the first version because for developer, for example, this is really interesting and important. We need to adapt our application for that new interaction. Okay, those are the first impressions about the new HoloLens 2 device. Hope you enjoyed this video and we are going to continue working to push the limits about what is possible to do with this kind of technology because no one has used a similar technology before. If you want to be part of this, please contact us. Thanks for watching.